I think you're in the wrong locker room. Nope. Pretty sure I'm in the right place. This is for wrestlers. Don't you have a ball to kick somewhere? Glad you're familiar with my previous line of work. But those days are behind me. I'm looking forward to proving myself here. This isn't soccer. No one's mommy is gonna bring you orange slices. Training here isn't like anything you've done before. I've got more bumps and bruises than a rotten jackfruit. And I've pulled muscles I didn't even know I had. <sighs> you have no idea what you've gotten yourself into. I spent the last decade dedicating myself to winning national championships and gold medals. I know how to put in work. Not like this. While you spent the last decade being catered to and taken care of, I trained in Calgary, the epicenter of wrestling, and then fought the best independent wrestlers in North America. And I've gotten the scars to prove it. We've all taken different roads to get here. Now, it's time to find out who deserves to stay. I've worked too hard for too long to get here, to let some walking shin guards fresh off the pitch steal my spot. I don't steal things. I earn them. Well, you've already earned a beatdown from me. So good luck. Hey, I'm Mei Lee, but everybody calls me Fanny. Nice to... because my last name is Fan and I'm a WWE super fan. And hopefully someday when I make it to WWE, there'll be Fandemonium. Get it? Sounds good, Fanny. Nice! I am so excited you're here. Oh yeah, are you a soccer fan too? Nope, I'm just tired of being the new girl. It's all WWE for me. I can't get enough. I even follow indies like PCW. You ever heard of Buzz? Yeah, I've even seen him wrestle once or twice. Once or twice? I've seen him wrestle 2,009 times. Most of them in person. Am I gonna have to be deposed in a court case? He actually put in a good word with management to get me in here. And this has been the best two weeks of my life. Well, maybe not quite as good as the two weeks I camped out for WrestleMania tickets in New Jersey. It was colder, but there were a lot fewer surprise super kicks. You know WrestleMania, right? Yeah, I don't live under a rock. It's only the biggest, greatest, grandest event in the entire universe. It's the crown jewel of sports entertainment. I've been six times, as a fan, obviously, but maybe, I mean, could you imagine? Fandemonium in the ring at WrestleMania? Anything can happen in WWE, right? So who knows? Maybe I'll be right there with you. Awesome! Sup, new girl? Welcome to the PC. Thanks. I'm happy to be here. Even though I'm mainly training the men right now, I'm always around if you need any advice. Good to know. One thing I can share with you right now is that in this business, you either have it or you don't. My daddy taught me something a long time ago. You could polish a dog turd all day, but at the end of the day, it's still doo-doo. I'm not sure I totally understand. Me neither. Why would anyone even want to polish dog poo? It's disgusting. Anyway, trust your gut, pick your spots, and make sure you don't end up in the D-O-double-G house. Good luck.
<laughs> First off, I'd like to officially welcome our newest recruit to the start of our WWE journey. If you hadn't noticed, there's a lot going on behind the scenes today, so fortunately, I don't have time to go through the big corporate speech that old Vinnie Mac and his pals in HR require me to give every single time a new trainee arrives. So we're going to cut to the chase. Have you met Chase? He used to dress like a giant rib. Huh? Fanny, zip it. Sorry, Mrs. Glamazon. Okay, as you may or may not know, the WWE superstars just finished up a huge European tour. Unfortunately, a big storm hit and now their plane won't make it back in time for Raw in Miami tonight. There are a few superstars who weren't on the tour that are able to make the show. But now Sasha Banks doesn't have an opponent. OMG, the boss! Fanny! Anyway, we heard from Raw GM Mandy Rose that they're scrambling to find someone to take on Sasha. So, that's where one of you comes in. I'm already packed. Let's go. That's great. But we haven't made a decision on which one of you will face Sasha tonight. And in WWE, we like to solve our problems in the ring. There's no decision. It's me. She started hyperventilating the moment Beth walked in. You think she can wrestle on live television in front of the entire WWE universe? I can do it. I'll be fine. Whoa, whoa getting dizzy. I better sit down. Yeah, I'm out. And she hasn't been here long enough to know where the restrooms are. Third door on the right. <sighs> it's second door on the left, but close. Look, we're on a tight schedule, so we need to make a call one way or another. Josie, you've been a bit banged up recently. Are you even up for this match? I can do it. Sasha Banks won't know what hit her. Okay, problem solved. Josie will go face Sasha. Not unless she gets through me first. The decision has already been made. I thought in WWE we solve our problems in the ring. Yeah, most of the time we do. But this is different. We're on a time crunch here. Sean, she's got a point. Okay, okay, fine. You two, get in the ring. Winner goes to Raw to face Sasha Banks. And whatever you do, make it quick.
What do you want? I know I'm the one going to face Sasha Banks now, but just wanted to say, nice match. Thanks. I'll admit you're better than I thought. But you're lucky I'm not 100%. If I was, I'd be the one taking on Sasha Banks tonight. So next time we fight, I promise it won't be anything like our first encounter. I look forward to seeing you at your best. That was amazing! Are you so excited? I'm so excited, and I'm not even going to Raw. How springy do you think the mat will be? Same as here, or slightly different? Do you think Sasha Banks will smell good? Will you bring me back something from catering? Oh, and some hotel shampoo? Fanny, you're starting to hyperventilate again. I know! This is embarrassing! You're the one going, and I'm hyperventilating! <gasps> I guess I'm just hyperventilating on the inside. Right. I'm gonna go try to calm down. Good luck, and don't forget the shampoo! Ugh, what are you doing here? What do you mean? I'm here to face Sasha Banks tonight. They sent you? You've been at the PC for what, 24 hours? I think it was just under three, actually. Great. I mean, first it was the travel issues and now this. Do you think the other GMs have to deal with this crap? No, they don't. They could have at least sent someone who spent some time inside a real ring. I thought it would be Josie Jane. So did she. But I'm here now, and I plan to make the most of my opportunity. Okay. I guess we'll have to make it work. Just try not to embarrass yourself or me or Raw, okay? You know what? That's too much to ask. Just don't get hurt. What's up? I'm our truth Welcome to Friday Night Raw. Isn't it Monday Night Raw? Man, I was one of the lucky ones who made it back from Europe. I'm so jet-lagged, I don't know what day it is. But Raw is always on Mondays. Only if you don't have a DVR. Anyway, someone told me you were a PC girl. That's right. Cool. I don't know nothing about computers, but I'm starting to think that fad is here to stay. It certainly looks that way. Listen, a little birdie told me you were here to face Sasha Banks. That's true. I'm hoping to give her everything I've got. Enough about that. The real question is why are birdies telling me other people's secrets? I don't know. One of life's great mysteries, I guess. Anyway, good luck again, Sasha. I got a feeling you're going to be fine. But keep an eye out for any gossiping birds. They're bad news. Thanks. Who are you? I'm actually your opponent tonight. No, you're not. I don't wrestle fans. I'm not a fan. Well, I am a fan, you know, 
of yours. And WWE, of course. But, I mean, I'm from the PC. I know who's at the PC. You? Ain't one of them. I just started today. And they sent you to face me? Are you kidding? I was supposed to have a Raw Women's Championship match against Naomi tonight. And now I'm facing off against this joke? <laughs> Wait, are you dying? And this is your wish? Look, I get it. I'm brand new here and not what you expected. But what you can expect is for me to give you everything I've got. I can't imagine that's very much. I'm a boss. You're a nobody. After tonight, I might be a somebody. tonight where due to the fact almost the entire roster was stranded overseas you're going to see some fresh faces on raw and one of those fresh faces is sasha banks opponent who just started at the performance center earlier today it's one thing to be a rookie and take on the boss but this is insane i have a feeling her face is going to be so fresh after this is over into the corner this can't be good It's okay, they weren't that pretty anyway. Trying to chop her down with a low kick. She had bank scouted. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. Guys, the boss is in bad shape here. Oh, you hate to see Sasha like this. You can see her struggling to find her bearings. The boss averts the attack. Turned that one around. Oh, wow. Lights out. Hooked up. Oh, she goes. Oh, she. Those mount 
grabs it with punches and not oh a nasty stomp to finish it off. She's got her in her sights. This combo is out of this world. It's a lunar one. Back just stacked the deck against Banks. Cover. One, two, three. Unbelievable. She did it. She beat Sasha Banks in her WWE debut. I never thought I'd see this happen here tonight. She just started the performance center this morning. This is unheard of. And the boss wants something to do with a handshake. She's livid. Sasha Banks is in shock right now. I would be too. Nonetheless, what a moment. You sure are luckier than a skinny caribou in September. Lucky? I beat Sasha Banks fair and square. Don't ever forget the only reason you were there was because I was hurt. That should have been me. I know you're angry at missing out. I would be too. But I also know that you would have been happy to face Sasha if things were reversed. Maybe. But that doesn't mean I'm going to forget what happened. Or that I'm going to stop trying to take out my frustration on you. You can try, but I'm no one's punching bag. Okay, tell me everything. How did it feel? Winning? I mean, it felt great, obviously. No, not that. I want to know about the ring, the ropes. How was the catering? Do they use real silverware or plastic? Oh, do they have extra underwear in case you get so excited that you pee a little? Um, I didn't ask. Did you shower after? Sorry, stupid question. I don't think I would, though. Talk about a sweat souvenir. I can't believe you beat Sasha Banks. Do you want to watch the match? I've recorded the whole thing on my phone. I've seen it about 30 times already. No thanks. I was there. I know how it turned out. Ha! <laughs> totally. I'm gonna watch it again, though, either way. Still can't believe it! See you out there, champ! Like everyone else, I was glued to my TV last night. Congratulations! A really impressive win, especially right out of the gate. Thanks. I'm glad I was able to prove myself. 
let's not spend too much time in the afterglow. You still have a long road ahead of you. Time to get back to the grind. I know. I still can't believe I beat Sasha Banks on Raw. But I'm not gonna let one match, even a win that big, define my career. I'm here to be the best I can be. Good. Because after what I saw, I'm getting in the ring with you myself. And uh, now? My neck's still a little stiff from last night. <laughs> Nothing a few glam slams can't fix. Come on. Let's find out if you got lucky last night, or if you really are that good.
tell us what to do. Yeah. You think you can tell us what to win? Yeah. You think you better? Yeah. Well, you better get ready to bow to the master. Okay, I guess now we know you really are that good. Thanks, but don't worry. I know I've got a lot left to learn. You do, but you've also got talent. And right now, the only limit I see to how far you can go is how hard you're willing to work. Guess it's time to get back to the grind. Guess so. Keep it up. Well, if it isn't Miss Lucky. I earned everything I've gotten, Josie. You know that. No, you haven't. If I hadn't been banged up, I would have been the one to defeat Sasha Banks, not you. I guess we'll have to agree to disagree. Agree to disagree? No, we won't. I'm finally 100%. I want a rematch. I'm not afraid to get my nails dirty. I'm in.
Your submissions are weak, just an FYI. Maybe you need an up-close demonstration. No. I can see how weak they are from a kilometer away. What makes you such an expert anyway? I'm from Calgary. We have a great tradition of submission wrestling. I thought you were from Saskatoon. That's close. Is it? Well, I trained in Calgary. That's right. I had forgotten that. The hearts are from there, right? You trained with them? Well, no. I trained with Riley Flash. And he was trained by a guy who trained with a guy who knew them pretty well. So, you know, osmosis. Hey, that's still a connection. I've heard of Riley Flash, too. He's legit. I'm not sure about the hair, though. Right? Listen, how about we get in the ring and have a good old-fashioned Calgary submission match? What's a Calgary submission match? Same as a regular submission match. But someone from Calgary is in the ring. So, really a Saskatoon submission match. You want to wrestle or not? Take it easy. Let's find out whose submission game needs work.
what to do. Yeah. You think you can tell us what to wear? <laughs> you think you better? Yeah. Well, you better get ready to bow to the master. Stuck in the way, you can see the fool. Got something cool lined up if you're interested. You could be in the next WWE 2K video game. Really? That's amazing. Well, to be clear, it wouldn't be you, as in like a character that is you. But when someone is getting beat up in the game, that will be your movements. You're not really selling this. You get to wear one of those cool mocap suits. Get to? Basically, the producers of the game need you to last five minutes with a WWE superstar so they can get enough footage of their moves. Would I at least get a free copy of the game? No promises. So do you want to do it or no? After they see me in the ring, there's no doubt they'll give me a bigger role. That's the spirit.
Big news, we just got word that Triple H has decided to hold a PC showcase to scout the talent here. Who do I need to impress? The GMs from all three brands will be here. And all three are bringing a superstar from their brand to give them an extra set of eyes on you. But they won't just be watching. We've been really impressed with how you've been doing down here. So we couldn't think of anyone better to square off against one of the visiting superstars. The GMs also want to see your full presentation, so you'll be in your wrestling gear and everything. Cool. Which superstars will be here? Shotzi Blackheart will be here from NXT, Lacey Evans from SmackDown, or, if you really want a challenge, Sasha Banks specifically requested to be the representative from Raw. All you have to do is figure out who you want to face. Keep in mind, if you could pull off a win over a tougher opponent, you would do more to impress the GMs. Do you even have to ask? You know I'm picking Sasha. I think everyone was hoping you'd say that. She's fired up. Be ready. Thanks, God! Expert! You think you can tell us what to do? Yeah. You think you can tell us what to win? Yeah. <laughs> you think you better? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. 
Are you, like, so pumped? We get to meet William Regal! Do you think he'll sign my action figure? You have a William Regal action figure with you? Always! You never know! Uh, do you think they were just in the neighborhood, or is something special going on? We're having a PC showcase. The GMs are coming to see if any of us are ready to be signed. What? I stopped listening after they said who was coming! This day just gets better and better! I cannot believe it! They're starting to hyperventilate again. I know. It's better I get it out now. I hope you're not too excited about this showcase. I'm not excited. I'm just focused on showing everyone what I can do. Again. So am I. You know everyone's coming to scout me, right? I'm finally healthy, not like when you fluked into your match against Sasha. I'm gonna destroy Fanny and let everyone see who Josie Jane really is. Good luck. There's room in WWE for both of us. Let's go put on a show. Ah! <laughs> 
That was a hell of a match. I have to admit, I didn't think you had it in you. I guess you now know not to underestimate me. I do. And if you're interested, we'd love to have you on SmackDown. What do you say? I'd be honored. Thank you. It's been a dream of mine to share the ring with some of the best in WWE. I can't believe I'm going to get the chance to do that on SmackDown. I wouldn't be signing you if I didn't think you had a chance to be one of the best, too. Welcome aboard. I guess you expect me to congratulate you. No, but I'd appreciate it. And I'm sure you'll get your chance before long, too. You're not the only one who's getting out of here. I just got signed to SmackDown, too. Well, good for you. It'll at least be nice having a familiar face over there. Yeah, and at least they're getting one real wrestler. And I get a front row seat to watch you flame out. We'll see. We're moving on up, girl! We did it! Did you get signed, too? Yeah! I'm bringing the Fandemonium to NXT! I mean, me with Rhea Ripley, Io Shirai, and Finn Balor? Can you believe it? I don't know how I'm gonna wrestle with sweaty pits and noodle knees. Congratulations! And remember, you're not a fan anymore. You're one of them. They might be just as excited to meet you. You're right! I bet Rhea Ripley is sitting at home right now, thinking, Crikey! I hope I someday get to meet Fanny! She's my idol! Totally possible. What am I gonna do without your pep talks? Can I call you when I start to freak out? I mean, not every time I start to freak out, but maybe one out of every five. I won't call while you're in the ring, although that would be kind of cool. Fanny, you'll be fine. But if you do need anything, you know where to find me. Thanks. You're the best. I got nothing to say to you. You could start with congrats. You got lucky. Again. And if I see a single post on social media about this, you and I are going to have problems. After our two matches, how can you think that sounds threatening? At least you're going to SmackDown, where I don't have to look at you. Let's keep it that way. Congratulations. Yeah, we think this is an absolutely perfect fit for you. Just remember, this isn't an ending. It's the beginning of the next chapter of training. You're always learning in WWE. Having a long and successful career means you never stop pushing yourself to be better. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind. But be sure to stop and appreciate the moments. Otherwise, it'll be over in an instant. Okay, okay, got it. You know I'll still be available via phone, right? And I'll probably still come in here to work out on off days. You don't have to cram every piece of advice into this conversation. Just trying to help, but I hear you. Good luck out there.
in SmackDown's latest acquisition. The Blue Brand is lucky to have her. I tend to think everyone's replaceable, especially you, Saxton, but this superstar brings something different to the table. She's truly one of a kind. We did a listener poll recently on my podcast, and turns out they'd be pretty pumped to see an Iron Woman match on SmackDown. Want to give the people what they want? Just a multitude of strikes. 
strikes. Rights and left elbow. Oh, uh, look at the after glory. Crosses out. That's it. Pressure on her keeps escalating. Yeah, she's having issues fighting back. And Nikki isn't looking helpless anymore. Yeah, Nikki getting that crazed look in her eyes again.
Oh, rapid fire. Oh! And this amount of damage looks like it's gotten overwhelming. It the body to take so much before it fails on you. She gets a fall. She finally put this away. Tap one after her score. Oh, oh, oh. oh that's the goal of combo. Unloading their best shot once more. She's rising back up on those lovely legs. Could set something else up. Suited bionic elbow. She's got an answer for that. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. <laughs> Enough already. Cross has that intense look in her eyes. Looks lost and won't like what's coming. This combo is out of this world. Oh, it's a lunar one. And just like that, it's all over. It's the cover. Two. And she got one. Targeting the throat there. Forced out of the ring. Sink or swim time. Launcher set up in the corner. And full control here. Face first. Pow, what a shot. Right across the larynx. She is 
scored. He saw it coming and got out of there. What a shot. There, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. She adjusts it and reverses it. <laughs> Bullseye with the back fist. And a bad exchange there for Cross. Yeah, Nikki has to recover quickly. It's sink or swim time. Sister, look at these vicious kicks to the jaw. Just mounted with punches and not. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Spot wow, Nikki Cross manages the counter. Oh, stop in the way. Just nasty. Slips out of the way there. What reflexes? Left by the turnbuckles. Connects on the kick. Here comes another one. That is going to leave a mark. Makes a cover. Two. She kicks out. I don't believe it. How close was that? That was about as close as it could get without it all being over for her. Big maneuver executed perfectly, but still was not enough. Draped across the top rope. Oh! Whiplash neckbreaker. She is queuing it up again. And she and I cross. She scored a fall late in the match. Oh, rapid fire after blow combo. That's got to do it. That's Gotta be it. So this down. One, two. Oh, oh kick out, kick out at two. Are we sure that wasn't three? Uh, just about as close as you can get. The best shot was thrown, but it couldn't put this match away. Oh. This combo is out of this world. Oh. Oh. Combo. Couldn't have done it better myself. performance and win here tonight. Practically an inhuman effort in terms of resilience on display throughout this match. You really have to hand it to them. They earned this victory. I tried to tell Lacey Evans what a fan I am of the woman's right, but she just called me a nasty, laughed, and walked away. Any chance I could persuade you to stick up for me? I guess I am a bit nasty, but I'm not a nasty. There's a difference. Bro.
scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from Portland, Oregon, the rocker, Carrie Elizabeth Bryce. Her athletic skills and toughness are undeniable, but she needs to watch herself because if she's not careful, she'll receive an education she won't like. There's no injury time in WWE like there is in pro soccer. this superstar has been putting in in order to meet the kind of challenge he faces tonight. Without a doubt, we've seen the hard work paying off. You don't find yourself in a match like this without dedicating your time into your craft. All that time spent has her in a good position to pull off a victory here. And with Lacey Evans, you have a superstar who seems more concerned with appearances than she does in-ring antics. But do not let that fool you. Lacey Evans is about as dangerous as they come with a mean streak to boot. Yeah, Lacey Evans is the picture of discipline in pinup model form. Takes another trip to the skies, and it pays off once again. That was just a difference of nanoseconds. And right there, Evans finds out she's not the only dangerous and disciplined competitor in this match. Yeah, but too soon to be worried. Sent into the corner. Evans with the retaliation. of ring IQ on display there. Lacey pins that off. And Evans is really being knocked around here. And Lacey needs to rethink her strategy fast. Blast off! And she doesn't connect. And now she's climbing to the top turnbuckle. Watch out! Diving foot stop! Brutal! Rolling elbow right on the This combo is out of this world, folks. It's a lunar one. Will that stop Lacey? The cover. One, two, three. And that's all she wrote. Here is your winner, the rocker, Carrie Elizabeth Bryce. Wrestle perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. Never a doubt. Barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come.
It's not every night that SmackDown superstars get an opportunity to impress Stephanie McMahon, but Lacey Evans and her opponent both have that chance here tonight. What a huge development. Everyone knows it only takes one word from a McMahon to accelerate your career in WWE. Clearly, Saxton's still waiting for his word. Oh, man. to the mush. Saw that one coming. Oh, blow to the bread basket. She had it scouted. Ooh, sharp kick. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Saw that one coming. Just a barrage of stomps. Oh, my goodness. They're striking at will. Now, oh, trampling the opposition. Uh-oh, second rope. Big miss right there. Oh. Lacey reverses it. Bruising attack to the stomach. Oh, it didn't go as planned there. She's showing signs of slowing now. But all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. And Lacey is on the downside of things now. Yeah, Lacey needs to rethink her strategy fast. Rolling elbow. Woo-wee. Lacey fends that off. Beautiful athleticism. Hurricane Rana. Oh, not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Check this out, guys. Double under will come in. Byron's going to love it. The Buster. Lacey Evans in full control. Will that do it for Lacey? Will that do it? the end of her. You have to wonder what more does she have left? We have reached a whole other level here. Sometimes when you unleash your best offense and it doesn't get the job done, you're taken out of you. Uh-oh. Way too oh. Lacey's attack gets reversed.
I can't believe you embarrassed me in front of Stephanie McMahon. Especially when the stakes were so high. Embarrass you? I just did my job and won the match. You knew I was at a disadvantage. I was up all night with a sick chicken and then had to help my daughter with a school project. I had to rush to make my flight and accidentally packed a pair of boots that are two sizes too small. Right. You bet your sweet cheeks I'm right. I'm the one who deserves the spotlight at Evolution, not you. I think we're gonna have to agree to disagree on this one. Yeah, okay. Well, next time my daughter has a school project, it's going to be a report on why you're a nasty thing. It looks like Lacey didn't want to wait to show what she could do at Evolution. In an unforeseen turn of events, the vicious attack from Lacey Evans has just completely upended tonight's schedule. Nikki Cross will have to wait as Nikki's scheduled opponent will now look to even against Lacey Evans, who apparently has some hard feelings about the upcoming Evolution event. You know what they say about best laid plans, right, Saxton? There's always a best plan until somebody gets laid out. Ball straight for all. Stomping. Ouch. Oh, saw it coming. Oh, kick. She's beginning to flag a little. She can withstand the punishment, though. Launching. Diving foot stomp. Brutal. Mounted with punches and not oh a nasty stop to finish it off. Evans with the retaliation. Ooh. Oh, quite an effective counter. Going for the run! Choke slam! She's able to get out of the way. Making that shoulder a priority. She has to mind the 10 count. Making that shoulder vulnerable. Now oh, that got turned around on Evans. Two. Oh, straight forearm. Oh, she turns it right around with a counter. Oh, attack to the midsection. She's starting to drag a little bit. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. Check this out, guys. Double underhook coming. Byron's going to love this. The Doom Buster. The cover, shoulders down. She keeps the pressure on, the next one might do it. Countered it just in time. The sleeper is cinched in, and you can see little by little the opponent is fading. 
Look at this. She releases the hold. That's a little surprising, no? Very impressive array of strikes. It's a little Will that stop Lacey? Makes a cover. Bro. entertainment that compares to evolution and stephanie mcmahon has helped deliver an unbelievable show yet again sorry saxon could you repeat that i couldn't hear over all the sucking up let's keep it moving shall we the winner of this falls count anywhere match will face wwe hall of famer trish stratus later tonight and for lacey evans or her opponent that could be the opportunity of a lifetime Got turned around on Evans. Really just laying it in. Jumping knee strike. I like that. Headed to the top row. She's getting back to her feet, but is there fight left? From the top, oh, she misses the mark. Oh, 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 what a punch. A sit-out match slam. What impact. Oh, man. Teen off. Oh, right to the kidneys. Hooked up. Into the neck breaker. She's forced onto the defensive now. 
She can still turn it around by taking this fight wherever she wants it. Ouch! Caught her. Oh my goodness! The knee right to the gut. That's one way to create some separation. Continuing to attack the neck. Draped over the top rope. Oh, just turned that around. with the retaliation. Oh, straight forearm. Oh, boy. Here it comes. Will she get fully locked in? Things not going how she wants. Ball's cut anywhere matches are absolutely no joke. And they're showing us that firsthand right now. From the top...